winter baby Slip a sable under the tree for me I've been an awful good girl Santa baby And hurry down the chimney tonight Santa baby And not a space convertible to light blue I'll wait up for you, dear Santa baby And hurry down the chimney tonight Think of all the fun I've made Hello there, Rogue Shippers! Last episode, we went to Craft Santa Museum in Antipolo to see the beautiful and extensive collection of Santa Claus items exhibited in a house inside Hunting de Miramar. This is part of our Christmas in Antipolo series. But our tour does not end there. Right after Casa Santa Museum, we head straight to Antipolo Cathedral to see a park just in front of it all dressed up for Christmas holidays. So tara na, let's go there! So we are here now at the Antipolo Cathedral but the venue itself that we are going to feature is not the church but the park in front of it which is well we cannot see it here but it is the park over there the Sumulong Park let's go So this is Sumulong Park, so this is just in front of the Antipolo Cathedral and just beside ng uh, Antipolo City Hall. So every year, uh, during this time, sometime in November and December, they set this place up for Christmas and this year the theme is Antipolo Carnival, something to that effect. So. Uh, you could see uh, a merry-go-round under the big Christmas tree over there which they normally set up every year during Christmas season and aside from that they decorate the facade of the church as you could see may mga parang um, banderitas that looks like carnival here being true to uh, a carnival theme they are introducing in 3d art available for everyone for public and as you can see the 3d art is well and theme and 3d art is basically animals which is pretty much part of the carnival setup right And you could also take pictures of this parang hot air balloon as you could see the girls over there. So 
every night uh, binubuksan tong ride na to it's parang kamukha lang siya ng ano ng merry go round and ganyan ko lang nakita siya na nakaset up under a christmas tree last year it's different eh hindi ko alam yung theme pero last year is a different theme a different christmas tree And here are the activities for December, actually starting from November, uh, that will happen in Antipolo. And it looks like there would be activity going on probably tonight. Setting up this stage over here for some uh, party. I think i sasabay nila to for the fiesta ng Immaculate Conception, which is yung fiesta ng which is in Fiesta na Antipolo Cathedral, Immaculate Conception. So, they're setting up this stage. Hindi pa naka-set up, pero uh, I think they would set it up later. Um, siguro balik tayo later on. Pag and now, guys, we're heading to our next destination. Our final destination for this tour. And we're going to Inare Center. Tara, let's go! center and you have the Christmas village in here which is uh, normally siguro, it is just three o'clock I think they all So, we're here right now at the Rizal Provincial Capital Compound. Actually, uh, that's the capital of Rizal. Uh, it is better known as the Inares Sports Complex because you could find the Inares Sports Coliseum over there. Normally, they hold the PBA over there. Sa mga hindi nakakaalam. So, the reason why we are featuring this uh, uh, venue is that on a yearly basis, uh, sometimes September, uh, they... they always set up the Christmas Bazaar at the open uh, parking area over there. Malaki kasi yung compound nila. So they held, they always hold this uh, Christmas Bazaar and food park every year. But this year, it's um, let's go there. So this year, it's a bit different because um, they introduce uh, a new theme which is what they call Christmas Village and the idea of the Christmas Village is to showcase the different um, products of the different municipalities of Rizal. So, tara, puntahan natin. Immediately, what you could actually notice in here is that the island leading to the sports complex is lined up with Christmas trees. And the uh, um, unique thing about this one, each Christmas tree is made up of recyclable materials. The giant Christmas tree this year, as you can see in there, kasi taas siya ng Capitol building, is also made up of recyclable materials. Maganda yan, umiikot yan paggabi. So these are the different stalls ng each municipalities.
see if it's open at 3 p.m. onwards until 2 a.m. in the morning. Depende sa dami ng tao. So, unfortunately, sarado sila. So, uh, we cannot really see what is inside. Kailangan natin balikan later. The main idea nung ginawa nila when it opened up sometime in September, uh, the plan is to only um, showcase the different municipalities of Rizal. So, yung pinaka-boutiques na nandito lang or stores na nandito lang is exclusive for, for those. Uh, then, they would sell stuff inside their own stores. Like, for example, the one for Antipolo, there are there are different stalls dun sa loob but syempre just like in any other um, initiatives once people uh, visited the place already um, it's fine uh, it's hard to actually maintain the number of people visiting kasi napuntahan na nila so um, after a few weeks of trial or actually just a few days of trial they noticed that it's not as many people visiting the capital just like in previous years so after that they started opening up uh, boutiques or bazaars again so yung christmas village is now is now um, populated with uh, different changge na the venue itself is lined up with different food stalls marami food stalls so after having a hearty um, tour of the place and buying a lot of uh, things from the Changge uh, for Christmas gifts and you know what, what have you you could actually visit the food stalls nag enjoy ka na sa sights nag enjoy ka na sa sounds and pabubusog ka pa And just like this is Sumulong Park, they have this stage set up for different activities. Last time that I went here, merong ginaganap na live band over there. But from time to time, and I'm guessing sometime pag malapit na yung Christmas, there would be live performance over there. And if you're not totally done yet, at uh, gusto mo pa mamasyal, uh, just beside it, May nakasetup dito ng carnival, basically carnival mismo or peria that you could actually try out. So, meron dito, as you can see, meron dito mga rides, yung Viking, which is similar to, ah, hindi ko alam pa na tawag sa Enchanted Kingdom, but it swings from side to side. Then you'll have the spiral jet in there, wherein it revolves. Tapos yung mga upuan mag uh, centrifugal force would force you to go sideways then we have the usual over there over there you have the usual merry-go-round and I believe somewhere there in that area may ferris wheel and of course just like in other areas you have the different uh, board games dito. and yeah uh, anything that uh, the kids would enjoy during Christmas um, so everything's in here so yeah you, you would actually spend some time here enjoying hello guys unfortunately mukhang kakabukas uh, pa lang ng Christmas village there's nothing to see here at this time um, wala masyadong tao actually uh, at ibang stalls nakasara pa um, I think it would be best na pumalik na lang tayo mamayang gabi um, either early evening or late at night anyways mas maganda nga naman na pumunta ng gabi the Christmas lights are up and I think all the stalls would be open by that time so for now let's head back home balik na lang tayo mayang gabi so see ya
And that is how Christmas is celebrated in Antipolo. On that note, we wish you a very Merry Christmas and a Happy Holidays. We say goodbye for now and see you in the next episode. Bye for now.